Okay, so this week we are going to be focusing on removing the panels on the walls. Whatever's behind there, we're going to have to take care of it. Rust, adhesive, uh, her smudging. She's very distracting. So after we <laughs> remove the rust, we're going to convert the rust using the product. And then we're going to prime it and paint it, seal it, and we're done. Now once we remedy whatever rust is there and get rid of the adhesive, we have like our, our blank slate. So this yep. is the last of the subtraction phase and next is the addition phase. Sure. Which is pretty exciting. Yeah, that's good. Okay, so first of all, yes, it is t-shirt weather in South Carolina on November 28th, 2017. I'm in the bus, it's about 7.30 at night. I'm gonna take up this floor. I think it's gonna take six hours. I don't know why. I had a dream that I should. Whatever. I want the rubber gone, so I'm gonna get rid of it. Do you want to climb that tree back there? You took the to get down? Do you think I can jump off here without hurting my legs? <laughs> Let's do more reckless things on YouTube. <laughs> How close am I? You got this, actually. Definitely gotten hurt in trees before. And I just have to climb them down like a, like a little ladder. And then swing from this one. You did it. Did it. We don't need no stinking ladder. Are you laying in our future bed? You're silly. Let's go. Oh, okay. Front ceiling panels out. Back ceiling panels out. All the wall panels are out. I've been taking out more of this rubber. I've got this splintery plywood. And I still don't know if I should stop taking out the rubber or if I should keep doing it. Val says, leave it be. It took me like an hour last night to do from here to here and that and that and the wall over here. You're like, what's under there? I don't know. Should I replace this plywood? I don't know. I do see why Val wants me to just leave it. It's a can of worms job. I'm taking off this leftover adhesive because I want to have a nice clean uh, level surface for me to attach my furry strips to. I also need to treat a little bit of rust spots. So once I get this off, I'm gonna wire a little anything that I find to be a little bit rusty. Can't show anyone. Uh -huh. <laughs> mm. Here you go. Good work on this bench. 
When I took off these wall panels the other night, we found a little bit of surface rust. You can see it remains a tiny bit. So what we did was we took a wire brush and an angle grinder. We used a couple different tools, but this is the one that we ended up with. And we grinded off all the rust uh, just to be safe. And there was a little bit on these seams. And after that, we used this rust converter. You know what, I already threw it away, so here it is. They didn't have OSFO at Lowe's, so I used this Loctite Extend Rust Neutralizer. And that's it. We also grinded this up. Uh, I don't really think this is rust. I think it's just some adhesive. Maybe it's a little bit of rust. It didn't really react to the rust converter the same. So we're just gonna prime it, uh, clean it and prime it, and then that'll be done. Still gotta figure out what to do about the floor. Today is the first day that I am a stay-at-home dad. Little Nova's sleeping here. She was a little bit cranky because she was sleeping in the car and I woke her up so I could put her in this carrier. But we're actually going to the DMV to try and see if we can get title transferred into our name for the bus. I don't even know if I have the right paperwork, but we're gonna figure out, ask questions, we'll make it happen. Nova's sleeping, life is good. See you guys later. Thank you.